Bullying is now being blamed for a 15-year-old girl's suicide. And now we're learning that a threat at the girls' school may be linked to her death. Roseanne Aragon joins us live now from Trenton with the story. Roseanne? Craig Carroll, it's a very sad situation that has the community raising the question, what more can be done here in the community and at the school? Now, I spoke with the family of the girl who is understandably heartbroken and have asked us not to name her, but the community wants them to know they're not alone. She was amazing. I miss her. 14-year-old Allie Mullen says her life here at Edgewood High School won't be the same. Her best friend, a 15-year-old fellow student, took her own life. She was just amazing, plain out amazing. Live was new last year. She showed me around. First one I got to know really good. And she just kind of introduced me to everybody, and I just kind of start fitting in with her. Little did she know things weren't emotionally right. And on September 17th, her friend would take her life. Students say it was from bullying. But Mullen says the school never explained what happened behind her friend's death. The school's like, stop spreading rumors. You need to stop. Okay, nothing's the matter. They didn't really say anything. Just the next day, a menacing report. An Edgewood High School student telling police he heard of two students who threatened to kill him and shoot up the school. Mullen's mother says the school should have done more. I got an email about her dying, and then my email went off again, and I got an email about possibly there was the school shooting. Not I got a phone call. I was mad I went off. Parents and students now claiming those students were the girl's friends, upset over her death and alleged bullying. As we reported Tuesday, two students were arrested for threats inducing panic. The report reads, the threatened student states this stems from an incident involving a fellow student who wanted to hurt herself and rumors of people wanting to hurt him. But this 14-year-old girl wants one thing. That bullying would stop and everybody would just stay Positive. Speak. Say something. Don't be depressed. Say something. Now, when we tried to get in touch of the superintendent Tuesday, he chose not to go into detail. We've tried again today to speak with him several times. We haven't had a response. We're live tonight in Trenton. I'm Roseanne Aragon, 9 on your side.